every money that you want to pray, there are a lot of things you can pray for each month. There are a lot of things. When Jesus Christ went to the Father that morning, and, and that, was his, that was his daily habit. When Jesus Christ went to the Father that morning, I believe he was there to draw strength. I believe he was there to draw grace. I believe he knew he was going to be confronted with all those Pharisees, with the demons and all the stuff he was going to deal with each day. And Jesus knew he needed to draw strength from his Father. So your early morning devotion is a time that you draw strength. It's a time that you draw grace from God. And I'm going to give you some guidelines, a few things you need to pray on each day in your morning, in your morning devotions. After you have submitted to God, after you have submitted to Jesus, but Jesus taught his disciples to pray, so I'm teaching you to pray. And after you've acknowledged the person of the Holy Spirit, then you need to ask God to help you. Ask the Holy Spirit to help you to love God with all your heart always that should be a prayer you pray each day ask for help to love god with all your heart the bible tells us that in the last days the love of many people will wax cold and a lot of us our love for god has waxed cold we're just pretending in church a lot of people go to church to just pretend but they don't have that love for god how you know your love for god has gone cold is that you now need follow up you need people to follow you up. You're no longer internally driven. David said, I was glad when they said to me, let's go to the house of God. Every time you need encouragement to go to the house of God, your love has gone cold. Every time you're dragging your feet and struggling in the things of God, your love has gone cold. So you should always be on your knees and ask the Holy Spirit to help you each day to love God with all your heart, that your passion for God will be stronger than ever. That today, Lord, my love for you will be stronger than it was yesterday. The fire in my heart for you will be stronger today than it was yesterday. Pray that kind of prayer every day of your life. And you notice that you continue to walk in passion. You continue to walk in love for God with all your heart.